Kevin says, any tips on stretching for those long practice sessions? There's a couple things that you wanna think about going into a long practice session. One is stretching, and that could mean stretching out your fingers, your hands, your wrists. Also, you may not think neck, back, all of that stuff, maybe even legs. These are all things you wanna do because you're not only using your fingers, hands, and wrists. It's a full body thing here. You're also sitting for a long time. So think about that, legs, back, get that into the mix for your, your warm up routine. The hands and the wrists and the fingers for stretching that stuff in particular, I like to do a few things. I like to open my hands as wide as I can, try and get each finger as far apart from one another as I can and as far out from my hand as, it, as I can. And then I like to switch to a completely closed fist, squeezing as tight as I can. And I like to alternate between those and I'll do that a few times and then I'll completely go loose and limp and just shake them out a little bit. That kind of gets the blood flowing a bit for me in that area. Um, I also like to sometimes lock my fingers together like this and then just twist them a little bit, not too hard. You don't want to feel pain there with your skin pulling or your, your fingers bending, but I like to loosen in between the fingers by doing that. I also like to take my hand and it doesn't really matter if your elbow is, is straight or bent. I like to pull back a little bit to stretch this part of my forearm. And if you stretch you know, from this, these sides of your fingers versus these sides, it can kind of get the left or the right side of that. But that's to kind of pull on this forearm. And then I'll do the same thing, pushing this way, which pulls on the top of your forearm this way. You can kind of go back and forth like that a few times with both hands. Spend several minutes doing a combination of those different things, depending on what you are feeling and what needs the most warm up. Potentially even after you're done as well, you may want to shake it out a little bit at the end of your long practice session as well. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'm Phil. Don't forget to hit subscribe and tap that notification bell. And be sure to check out the Playground Sessions interactive app. It was co-created by music legend Quincy Jones. Playground teaches the piano with interactive feedback and gaming features, all while using your favorite songs.